Stoddard Wolves. Today is Thursday, May 14th, 2020. Hey, sorry I missed you yesterday. Mr. McCants is working on a special project for fifth grade. Shh. Hey, this morning, I'm at Tubman Elementary right next to this beautiful mural that represents honoring diversity. Okay, and I thought it was only appropriate because this week is International Week. Hey, couple student shout outs. Huge shout out to Muhammad, Johnny Develia for Challenge 24. Hey, STEM students, keep those projects coming in. I know you're still working very hard, but keep those still coming in. Um, trampoline projects vehicle projects, and maybe you even started your animal shelter STEM project. If you don't know where that's at, look in teams underneath file. Hey, challenge 24 for today. Problem number one is three. Three, seven, and eight. I repeat, three. Three, seven, and eight. Problem number two is two, 12, nine, and four. I repeat, problem number two is two, 12, nine, and four. Hey, our quote of the day, it's a good one today. I never lose. I either win or learn. Oh, that's a good one. Let me say it one more time. I never lose. I either win or learn. Hey, families, that's a great one for a dinner conversation tonight. Core value of the week is environmental awareness. Hey, make sure that we are taking care of our environment. The more we take care of our environment, the longer we will be in this environment on earth. So pay close attention, environmental awareness students. Hey, student tips is self-motivation. So, hey, self-motivation means that you may wake up, you may put your headphones on, and there's just a song that gets you going in the morning. That's what I do in the morning. I listen to one of my favorite songs. It gets me self-motivated to help me to reach my goals every single day. Hey, we're almost to the finish line. Don't give up now. Hey, parent tips of today. Limit distractions. Why students are working, we know that there could be several distractions. Speaking of which, and I'm back, limit your distractions, okay? While you're focused on your schoolwork, you don't want all that other stuff around there that's going to take your focus away from what you're learning. All right, so, hey, moving right along, STEM design challenge for the animal shelter. Hey, I wanted to talk about this because day one, it specifies, you can go at your own pace, students, be as creative as you wanna be. This is your animal shelter. But this is what day one highlights. Think of an animal or several animals and do, do some research of what kind of shelter would be best for that animal or animals. Okay, let me say that again. Think of an animal or several animals, do research, research of what kind of shelter would be best for that animal or animals. Hey, resources. Hey, if you're getting bored at home, don't forget our museums, especially our Smithsonian's have virtual tours. Check that out, super cool. Um, also, huge shout out to Miss Martin, Miss Short, and Mrs. Hoyt. Hey, I wanna shout them out so much because they're not only checking in on students in our community, they're checking in on parents, they're checking in on teachers, they're checking in on Mr. Brian and Mr. Scott. They're making sure that we are feeling okay in these uncertain times. So thank you, thank you so much to Miss Martin, Miss Short, and Mrs. Hoyt. Hey, this is Mr. McCant signing off from Tubman Elementary with this beautiful mural that represents honoring diversity. Hey, International Week is almost done. So if you haven't done anything yet, post those pictures. We wanna learn about your culture. This is Mr. McCants. Have a great day on purpose. Bye-bye, see you tomorrow.